So we're actually ready to go ahead and get started now. So let's create a new request for the posts. And this is going to be a search request. This one's really, really exciting. We're going to grab the API URL, and then we're going to go to posts slash search. So this is one of the endpoints that Orion gives us. Now what we can do is come to the body over here, and we'll say raw, JSON, and let's put in an object here, and we're going to say search. So this is where we add all of our searching. And that's going to be an object, and we can say that the value is equal to, well, we don't actually know what we're going to be searching for. So let's go to index, run that. How about C-U-L-P-A-H-I-C, Culpa Hick. So I copied that, paste it in there, run it, and it's not going to work. Oh, and that's because this needs to be a post request. So let's send that again. And there we go. Now, notice that it's actually given us back all of the results. So it hasn't actually worked for us. And the reason it hasn't worked is because behind the scenes, we have to tell Orion what the user is allowed to search. Otherwise, they would search the ID, the created at, the updated at. We don't want them to be searching for every single field that would slow things down and it would also create unexpected results. So we actually have to specify that. So let's come in here and I'm going to go to post controller and this is how we do it. Protected function searchable by. So we got the searchable by function. It's very basic. We just return an array of the attributes that are searchable. So in this example, we'll do the title and you can search the body. And why don't we use that category as well? So you can search the category. So I'll come back here. Let's search it again. And this time it works, we only get one result, and that's the one with Culpa Hick. And by the way, we can search the category now, which is Laravel Orion. So let's paste that in here. And now we're only going to get results with the category of Laravel Orion. However, the problem with that is if the body also had Laravel Orion in it, that's kind of an issue because if you only wanted Laravel Orion categories, then you wouldn't really want to do it through a search. You'd want to do a filter for that or a scope. So you'd want to say, for example, just give me categories that are equal to Laravel Orion. Otherwise, you would get a few unexpected results. So we're going to actually cover that a little bit later on in this video. So that's how you do search. Super simple. And it's worth mentioning that down the line, there's going to be support for Algolia or Elasticsearch, or at least that's what's been alluded to in the docs. So if that didn't blow your mind, let's go ahead and look at filters.